Welcome everyone, Adam the Woo here. Look, that's a snake. We're right here in Alligator Alley in the Everglades. Me and Scott Eukin, he's doing a little research on the Everglades We're right here. based on this 1965 vintage map of alligators and birds and stuff. It's my second channel, Daily Blog Channel. We're in the Everglades. I don't know what that guy's doing right there, but I know what we're doing. We're snake hunting, it's the Daily Woo. If you haven't heard on the news, it's gained some national attention out here in the Everglades. They want people to come out here and hunt down pythons. You ever caught a python before, Scott? No, but they're an invasive species, and we can make some money if we catch some. That's true. The person who catches the most pythons gets a massive reward. In fact, if you do some Google research, you'll come to find out that over 500 people, non-permitted people, are allowed to come out here with their guns. And the news reports actually say that the way you kill a python is the same way you kill a zombie. I'm not even making that up. You do a headshot. Describe the headshot again. Ow. Just like that. Well, you're actually going to have a bullet. Yeah. Bullet to the head, yeah. and not, not, a, know, not a fingernail. Sense, uh, you know, yeah, the, the, the forehead of the thing, to the finger doesn't really do a lot of damage. So if you have a gun, come on out here. It's every, every man and every snake for himself. But we're in the Everglades today. We're going to wander around. We didn't bring our guns with us, no. so all we have is our fingers, like he was just demonstrating. Demonstrate it again? And, uh, and I got to... twice is enough. Let's give them a view of the Everglades here. This is what we're dealing with. We're going to go off into the wilderness of the Everglades. We've got some guys over here. They're either fishing or they're hunting for pythons. You place your bets on what they're doing. I'm thinking they're probably just fishing. Ooh, look, look. The vultures right there. Now, if you guys are going to come out here, remember the key rule is don't get bit by anything because if you're out there by yourself, you're dead! That's true. You will, you will not last long in the Florida Everglades being bit by a snake or that bird right there. Snakes and birds, birds and snakes, lions, tigers, and bears. Oh my! So I want to know what you guys think. Do you think it's a safe thing? for uh, the government to let people come out here. I guess it's the government. Everybody blames the government, so I'm gonna blame the government. You think it's a safe thing, Scott, for the government to let 500 people come out here why armed with weapons? Bit and shoot each other, yeah, why not? Inch by time. inch. They need to come out here and clean all this bird poop. The Everglades bird pooping crew is slacking out here. Probably gonna see some gators out here. Hopefully we get to see some gators. I'd rather see a gator than a snake any day of the week. Who would win that fight, gator versus snake? Who knows? All right, we're gonna end this video now. We're gonna go do some snake hunting. And I really, hopefully today, get to meet up with some hunters. I really like to get their take on it. Those guys aren't hunters. So we're gonna venture down that road, straight through Alligator Alley, which is now Snake Alley. So we're gonna see you later. Make sure you subscribe up here and hopefully if we meet any hunters, maybe I'll post them on my Facebook page. I'll do some uh, photographs with some snake hunters. Scott's, Scott likes photographs. You like photographs, don't you? Yeah. Do you want to get, you get some photos with some snake hunters? Yeah. It's America. America. Snake hunting without a permit. Thanks for watching The Daily Woo. See you tomorrow.